Well, a new traffic sign implemented on the streets of New Providence not only carries a hefty fine, but motorists have mixed reviews. Antoine Smith takes a closer look at the yellow box. As most drivers are aware, a green light signals your turn to go. But if you're at an intersection where there's a yellow box, it signals the possibility that you may have to wait. Last week, we reported on the traffic sign implemented to decrease traffic congestion during peak hours. But as we found out when we interviewed motorists in New Providence, the sign is something most drivers aren't too sure about. I have no awareness about the yellow box. I did not know about the yellow box. I don't know what the yellow box does. I don't know what it's for. I don't know its purpose or nothing. The yellow box is designed to act as a deterrent for vehicles which may block lanes during rush hour traffic, signaling drivers to wait behind the yellow lines until the way in front of them is clear. Drivers said, while it sounded nice in theory, they weren't too sure about how it would work. It's a very good idea, but a lot of my fellow Bahamians do not like to follow rules. It kind of makes sense, but, but you know, people still ain't gonna listen. I think it's a great idea and a long time coming. Um, because it really, if, if obeyed properly, um, it will definitely ease up the traffic. Most drivers seem to question just how police would be able to keep up with and enforce the law. When it came to the $300 to $500 penalty that comes if you're caught in the box during a red light, well, that came with mixed reviews. No, the fine is not hefty at all. If you don't break the law, then it won't be applied to you. Increase the fine if you want to. I, I feel like the fine do I for true. They're killing us. We don't need no money. They're killing us. It's a steep fine. But at this time, present time of the economy, everybody has issues with money. The motorists, however, seem to be on board for this one thing in common. And so you don't have to wait three, four life cycles and getting all impatient. The Ministry of Works urges drivers to take note of the yellow boxes at intersections all over Nassau. And if motorists adhere to the new rule, one thing can be certain. Easier traffic flow on Nassau streets and a faster drive home. Antoine Smith, Zenness Network News.